Good morning, good evening, good night. Whenever you guys are watching this channel, first subscribe. I did a video yesterday that we were going to get our quarterly antibodies test, my wife and I. And the last time we got it before that was August the 13th. And yesterday we went and took it, which was December the 13th, and they said it was going to take about a week to get the results back. But I just checked my email and I got my results back. So I'm surprised about these results. I want to share you guys with it. Maybe there's some doctors or nurses out there that can explain this to me or us. Uh, my wife has, hasn't got hers back yet, but I'll put the results in the description. Uh, the last time she got hers, hers was off the chart. It was like greater than 20. Mine was like 1.49. So anything over one that you know that you have antibodies for COVID. You've had COVID before or either you had the vaccine and, uh, and uh, got antibodies. But check it out. I'm going to go to August the 13th and let you guys look at it. I'm looking at it here on my computer. So we're going to go to August the 13th. Here we go. We're going to view the results here. And these is my results from four months ago. As you can see, my antibodies, it says anything that's greater than one lets you know, hey, you got some kind of, you got antibodies for COVID. You either had it in the past or you took the vaccine. And mine was a 1.49. Well, that's pretty high, but my wife's was greater than 20. And so hers was 10, 15 times higher than mine, but she had a lot more complications. And this was August the 13th, as you can see up there in, in the date, August the 13th. So let's exit out of this. And we're going to go to the results from yesterday, which was December the 13th, 2021. So these are my results from yesterday. And this is kind of strange. My antibodies count <laughs> went up, so I'm getting more and more protected. So as you can see, before it was one point, I think four nine, now it's four point two eight. I don't know, maybe some or doctors or nurses out there that can explain this. Um maybe I've had COVID again. I don't know. I haven't had no symptoms. I haven't had no fever, no side effects. So I don't know if my antibodies are increasing. I don't know why they're increasing. Which I'm good. That's good. Uh, that means hey, I'm I'm protected a little longer. And we'll go through this together. It says that hey, if your antibodies are higher than one, then you're protected. That means that you've had COVID or maybe you've had some kind of um or you had the vaccine so looking at these results i'm getting more and more and more protected i don't know if i've been around somebody who had, who's had covid and i may have got infected again and built up more antibodies i don't know i don't know how this stuff work i'm learning so any doctors out there can explain this to me let me know my antibodies are increasing and um like I said, my wife should get her results back today or tomorrow, and hers was all hers was greater than 20 four months ago. So I don't know if it went below 20 or it may say you're still greater than 20. So I don't know what her numbers is, but mine's increase by three points almost three times. So I'm good. <laughs> I got antibodies, so I put off taking a vaccine a little while longer. Um, like I said, I feel good. I haven't had no side effects. I haven't had, haven't lost my smell. I haven't had a fever. I haven't had a call for, I don't, somebody explain this to me. Why is my antibodies increasing? So I guess I get another one done in another four months. It might be eight or it may be nine or it may be one. I don't know. This stuff is strange. <laughs> So thanks for watching and subscribe to my channel. You guys are seeing what I see. So I'm protected. So I guess I'm going to go ahead and go to Florida and me and my wife go, go on us a trip. I think we'll go to the casino there in Florida. That, that casino is huge. It's a resort. But anyway, again, subscribe to my channel and have a great day.